first of all, I want to tell you about my little pocket Bible. Sandy and I, my wife, were, we were going to Grand Tetons for vacation, and we stopped at a little tiny town that just happened to have a small bookstore, and I bought this pocket Bible. This is way back in 1971. And I decided, you know, I really should be reading the Bible more. So I decided every time there was a blank space in our vacation itinerary that I'd pull out this little pocket Bible. You know, in the morning, men go to the bathroom and it takes 30 seconds. Uh, women, it takes about a half an hour, the makeup and all that. So I had lots of empty spaces I read through this Bible, this New Testament, three times in two weeks. Now I am going to share with you from Galatians. Galatians is Luther's favorite book in the New Testament. And this is my favorite passage from Galatians. It's Galatians chapter 2, verses 19 and 20. Paul says, through the law, I died to the law that I might live to God. I have been crucified with Christ, and it is no longer I who live, but Christ lives in me. And the life which I now live in the flesh, I live by faith in the Son of God who loved me and delivered himself up for me. Uh, this is a companion verse to the message on Sunday. And it does help us understand a little bit of the nuance of the, the Romans 7 passage. Paul says, through the law, I died to the law. When Paul took the law seriously, not just outward actions, but inner motives and inner attitudes and the heart, he says, whoa. I'm dead. I can't do that. But then he goes on to say, you know, I died with Christ. When he was crucified, I died. When Jesus died for me, it's as if I died. And now the life I live, I, I live by faith. You know, on Sunday I said, not only are we justified and accepted before God by faith, but we're also sanctified and radically changed by faith. And this is one of the clearest passages that tells you exactly what's going on. The life I now live, I live by faith in the Son of God who loved me and gave himself for me. The more you trust Christ, his love, his acceptance, his forgiveness, his gift of righteousness. Just stand back. Your life will be radically changed. You don't need all those other things that you used to do to be accepted and praised and valued by people and by God. You've got that in Jesus. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we, grant, we ask that again that we may die to the law so that we might come alive to God through faith in Jesus Christ, through faith in his love, his acceptance, his forgiveness, his gift of righteousness. We ask in Jesus' precious name. Amen.